All right, Shalom, Shalom. The real Hebrew Israelites coming day in and day out to prophesy the downfall of Babylon the Great. First off and foremost, all praises, honor, and glory be unto Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the elder apostles of uh, Great Millstone. Salutation uh, to the elect, wherever you uh, may be. Um, I'm just go straight into it. A nigga, uh, this nigga from ITR made an equation that uh, Acts the second chapter was the prophecy in um, Isaiah the 11th chapter, right? Well, context, right? I, you say context, so let's read within the text. Acts the second chapter, verse 14. Now, this is after, you know, the, the, the Jews heard their language from their own country, all right, from different countries they were from. But Peter, standing at the 11th hour, I mean, Salaki and Peter standing up with the eleven lifted up his voice and said unto them, Ye men of Judea and all that dwell in Jerusalem, be this known unto you and hearken to my words, for these are not drunken as ye suppose, seeing it is but the third hour of the day, which I believe is nine o'clock. But this is uh, that which was spoken by the prophet Joel, and it shall come to pass in the last days, saith Yahweh. I will pour out my spirit upon all flesh, and your sons and daughters shall prophesy, and your young men shall see visions, and your old men shall see dreams. And on my servants and on my handmaidens, I will pour out in those days the spirit, uh, and they shall pro uh, prophesy, man. So, that's the prophecy that happened in Acts, the second chapter. Not... Isaiah the eleventh chapter. And that was just a quick cut, but I guess people don't uh, read context, right? Hey, Shalom. All praises, honor, and glory be unto you. How about Shimia? How shall we call Kadash Barakatham to you? Akim, a Shalom, man. A depth to two thirds. A Abba Baba, man.